If there is one superhero who should have his own game, that would be Flash. Over the years of superhero games, Flash has for the most part been just a side character in them. And the only games that let you even explore the character are games like DC Universe, Injustice 2, or DC LEGO games. But I honestly want more than that. There was a time when Flash did almost get his own game back in 2008 on the Xbox 360 by Bottle Rock Entertainment called The Flash. This game would have had its own storylines, villains, and was structured around being an open world game. And man, if we ever got this game, I already know this would have been one of your favorite games growing up considering that a lot of you still love The Flash. But sadly, things happen and studios get shut down and the results end up leaving games like this locked up in the vault forever. But with the new Flash movie that just came out, I can only have hope that that movie can spark some more popularity into Flash's name and we can end up getting a new Flash game down the road. Until then though, today we will be playing two Flash games that fans created themselves so that we can experience just what it could be like to be the Flash in a video game. And here we go. We are back in the Into the Speed Force Flash fan made game. You know, I kind of been holding out on this game. It's been like, what, three months, I think? I believe so. But I mainly was just waiting for new things to come in the game. And it is made by one person. So think about how long it takes for one person to add a whole bunch of stuff in the game. And depending on like their skill set, some people can do it pretty quick. Some people can, you know, just how it is. But there were some things that were added, not too many things. Like it's just mainly buildings and whatnot. But as you can see, we're already like in a mock city. It's not complete, it's very minimal. And then we got a good look at Star Labs over there. We can't necessarily go in there, but I think in the next update, maybe the creator might let us go in there. I don't know, but there's kind of like a wall blocking the way. So can't necessarily go in there, but I do miss running on this game. It was pretty fast. Yep, I'm going slow-mo around here hope none of y'all get dizzy don't get dizzy now in my last video playing this game we were able to enter the speed force but it looks like we can't do it on this version i think because it's being reworked i got a few clips right here where the creator is like working on savitar adding him into the game and his own speed force trail and all that so this looks pretty good i think this is a cool thing that he can add in the game let me know what y'all think about this you think he should keep this or not you know just give him some good feedback and it looks like right here he's trying to add like a wall running ability which is something that flash does all the time and it would be a lot more fun to running up on the walls and all that and then it looks like he's trying to add flash's ring in the game you know the one where he keeps his suit in which is a pretty cool touch you know if we get to use that and have the suit come out and change suits but anything suits wise being different there's not too much you can see there's avatar right here that i can't click on he's not available yet but we still got all the other suits you know zoom and all the other seasons for flash the skill sets are still pretty much the same you know slowing down time throwing lightning and phasing through walls and it looks like we can still change our trail colors from the last demo so this is still another cool thing that he added in this game so with the abilities we still got the whole slow mode you know you can run around do this go around the corner speed up again slow down again go around that corner oh Use the control a little bit. It's a little bit fast, but I mean, it's flash. It's got to be fast. Do know we have this, which is another version of kind of slow speed, but everything around you would stop in time if you did this. So it, let's say people were shooting at me and I pressed this. That means everything around me would have stopped in time in my perception and I could run around, punch on them and do all types of things. You know what I'm saying? Then we still got our light bulb move. I think this was just for like lighting. You know, if we were walking around in a dark area, like let me uh, turn to nighttime, see how better it looks like. I'm running around, but I mean, to be honest, I'm just running around like this. It's enough light, but I guess if you just want to walk around, you got a little light ball, I guess. And then we have our light throw, which was you hold this, and then we can throw it like that. And then I can freeze time, like Flash usually does, or not necessarily freeze time, but just move really quick. Look at how much faster we are moving than this lightning bolt, or lightning ball, whatever you want to call this. That is crazy. And then another cool thing he could add with the lightning like that, we can slow down time and jump off of it like he does in the show where he jumps off the lightning. That would be sick. I ain't gonna lie. That's gonna, that would be sick. All right, let me go ahead and show the last thing that the creator added. So right here we have the CCPD. So let's go ahead, press X, walk in here. This looks just like how it is in the show, man. I'm telling you, on par with it. I mean, the colors are a little bright. Maybe you could fix with the shadows or something, but all that stuff can be added way later. And right up there, y'all should already remember what happened up there. That's when that boy Zoom ran all the way up here, was looking at them boys and caught all them bullets. Y'all remember that? Oh yeah, let me replay that clip for y'all.
Oh yeah, Buddy was not playing around. He was there on Demon Timing. But uh, let me try to go around. I think there's another room, right? This one. All of this looks pretty good. I am not gonna lie. It really completes the immersion of being in the CW Flash show. Like I didn't ever expect people to make a game for that show, but this looks pretty nice. I'm not gonna lie. And then if we ever get to go in Star Labs, we get to see all the cool stuff in there. Mm, I cannot wait. Hey, whoa, what is that? Oh, that's the Star Lab explosion. I didn't even know that was gonna be in this demo. Okay, that was pretty cool that I caught that. But you guys, I actually have another Flash game I wanna show y'all that actually has some pretty cool combat and it has a little bit more than this one. If you wanna go ahead and support the creator for this game, I'm gonna leave his Discord down below and you can go ahead and check it out and you can even download the game from that Discord. So go ahead and check that out. All right, everyone, this is the other fan flash game that I was talking about. It still has the same CW flash suits that the other game had, but it's still a little bit different. Now, this game, I'm not really sure what it's called because it was sent to me by a viewer after I posted the other fan flash game. But uh, this one's kind of cool. It does have wall running abilities like the other game didn't. But uh, yeah, that's a cool touch. You got the wall running and then I believe you got the phasing. See, I just phased through there. Which is funny that I fell through because if y'all seen one of the last community posters that I made, I had a picture of Batman stabbing <laughs> reverse flash in his foot because you're not allowed to phase through your feet because you fall through the earth. But uh, yeah, that's pretty funny. This one does have its own version of a flash throw too. And it's pretty similar. You know, you run around in a circle and you throw lightning. I think that's just something that's common. I believe it was in DC Universe as well. So it's just a common move that Flash does. This one's also pretty similar to the other game with the suits. It's just a whole bunch of suits from the series and you know, all the different seasons and whatnot, but it doesn't have Zoom or Savitar and all of them. Now, one thing that I like about this that I wanted to show you is the combat. So let me go ahead, spawn this dude. I'm gonna spawn Billy right there. I'm gonna spawn Joe. So what this game is, you can fight people actually. Like it has just a tad bit. I mean a tad bit of combat. So what I can do is, is I can press that button. And now they're gonna try to attack me. So what you can do, you can do this. I still take damage when I try to fight them like this, but look at that. That looks kind of cool, don't it? Mm-hmm. Run around, knock him out. He slept. They do be kind of eating my punches though. Come on now, y'all are goons. You're supposed to be dead after these punches. Look at my health. I'm about to die. You know, you need a little bit more damage, Flash. This is unacceptable. See, the combat's actually pretty decent. I'm not going to lie. It does really remind me of DC Universe Online, though. I don't know why, but it does. All right, now I spawned me some goons with some guns. So you already know we got to be quick on our toes with this. So I'm going to show you guys the Flash time. So let me go ahead and let them shoot at me. Slow down time. Look at that. That looks so fire, bro, with the bullets running around. I could just dance around these suckers. Yep. Keep on shooting them bullets. And I could just start attacking them just like this. Mm hmm. Don't even notice me attacking them. Throw that. Throw another one. Look at them. Getting punched on. This is broken. This is the flash everybody wants to see, but you never get it. Attack this guy and you. Yep, yep. Can't even see me. They don't even know what's happening. And then, stop. He fell out. Go back in slow mode. Punch on him. Y'all are eating way too many punches from Flash. I am not gonna lie. Like, look at them. They is eating these. All right, they should be good now. There we go. Flash should be able to handle these goons easily. Just throw lightning bolts at them. Now, nope. do all that. Get some more energy. Run up on them, slow mode. Run this way, phase through them. Can't do nothing. Watch out, watch out. Phase to them. Wait, hold on, hold on. Get me out of there. Throw this. Bam! Got all of them. Going flash time. Wrap all of them up. Punch you out. I don't know. This is fun. This is a little bit more funner than the other game just because I'm doing some combat. But other than that, this is pretty much the same game. Just running around. Comment down below what y'all think about this game. Sadly, I don't know how to download this game or where to find it. But some of you might know where it's at. So comment down below if you know where this game is for other people to download it. But uh, yeah, boys, that's it for the Flash games. Until then, we are out.